is Tabor Lycia for Lycia Guitars. Welcome to my wood shop here in Long Island City, New York. Here is a fretboard that I made, 25 inch scale fretboard. And this is a uh, 14 inch radius right here. I actually never had a space in New York City. However, I did grow up a good part of my life in New York City since my parents were artists. Uh, there's a lot of inspiration in New York, there's a lot of music, a lot of musicians, fantastic uh, place to play music. I also play music with my band Mortis here in New York all the time. Um, I'm also in the music building uh, on 8th Avenue in Manhattan. And uh, there's so much inspiration constantly in New York. It's, it's uh, it's overwhelming at times, um, and being a musician and talking to musicians uh, give you all the pointers and feelings from what they want and, and are strong about. Uh, uh, it's just uh, it's wonderful to put this into their hands and to watch them play the hell out of it. It's it's fantastic. Uh, all the sounds of uh, heavy guitar to a strat sound, five-way switch, single volume, very easy to play. This particular guitar has quarter-inch sapelli in the back. This guitar is a mahogany body with a bolt-on neck. So this was my first design, which is the same design as the body of the new guitars. And uh, I finished the guitar and was happy for a short while, but what I really wanted to do was to make a new neck. Present day, the economy is, is really not good, and uh, it's very hard to get somebody to pay for one of these. This is a handmade piece of art to me. It's, so um, that's the only problem that I have. Building them is no problem. Showing them is no problem. Putting them into a store, some people are a little reluctant to put it in their store because they've seen it all before, but they, they look at this thing and they hear it and they say, oh, okay, and they kind of believe in it and, they, and they, uh, they take it on. I didn't spend money on CNC machines and uh, computer controlled uh, uh, machinery, which is very, very expensive, even expensive to run. So this, I'm making sure that I can, I can take care of what I want to do. I can keep my art going and uh, not get killed by uh, heavy rents. It's important to keep my, myself sane. I would have to be a major manufacturer to handle a New York space. My idea of this came to me a couple years ago when I went to a furniture show at the Javits Center. And uh, there was a booth there. Uh, somebody selling bamboo, bamboo plywood, and I, I stood there with my mouth open, and I, I said, "That's it. Nobody else is building this with this, with bamboo." So to be in Montreux, Switzerland, somewhere, uh, in the near the lake in Montreux, making guitars and playing music in in the Alps, that would be, that would be incredible. Either that, it would be here, out west, Colorado, or Jackson Hole, Wyoming. One of those, you know, have a couple acres uh, of just beautiful land that would be really nice. And there's too much pride.